Today we're looking at a solution that combines two technologies that allows us to improve health and safety and understanding when it comes to the location of utilities on a live construction site. On the site that we're at today, we know we have a gas main and we know we have a power cable. What we're going to do is take the ground penetrating radar and the cable location equipment and we're going to survey in the 3D positions of those utilities. I've been out surveying uh, the utilities, so with the DS2000 radar and the EasyCat locators, um, we've traced them with the Xeno for high accuracy, and as we surveyed them in, they're going real time into the office via DX Manager mapping. I've received the data via DX Manager, which was transferred across via the cloud. I've then imported that into our Icon Office software, which gives me the overall layout of where the cables are. I create avoidance zones by offsetting the cables or pipes that we wish to avoid by a set dimension. That information then is transferred via the cloud and our telematics software back over into the excavator or dozer. Now we have established the positional data of the services and the possible exclusion zones. This same data can be used with augmented reality software on the Leica Xeno by anyone to understand these in a real-time live view across the site. The operator is able to dig according to the model. Looking at the screen, he's able to see where his bucket is in relation to that model and he knows when he's digging in the right position. When the bucket enters the, uh, the no-dig area, an audible alarm sounds and the bar comes up across the top of the screen to tell him that he's now trying to dig in an area where he shouldn't be digging. There's a final part of the demonstration and to show that the system is actually working, now we can see him digging in the no dig zone, in the avoidance zone, and we can see that he is uncovering the pipe within the area that he's not supposed to be digging. So the two main advantages here are from the health and safety aspect, we're looking to avoid more cable strikes by making the machine driver more aware of where he's digging and more importantly, where not to dig. The second advantage is that we're not constantly having to request a surveyor or an engineer back to the site to remark out where those utilities are because we have that constant live view within the machine.